Hey guys, welcome back to WP Event Manager. In this series, we are talking about our registration add-on. And today's topic is how we can hide this registration button from a particular event. So for this, we need to dig into our codes once again. So for that, I will really suggest you use an FTP or your web host's default code editor and avoid the WordPress default plugin editor or the theme editor. So I'm logged into my FTP in this tab. And as always, first we need to go inside the public HTML or htdocs folder. Then we need to go inside WP content. And then we need to go inside themes. And then inside our active theme directory. So in my case, that's event listing. And in here, we're gonna open the functions.php. So let's open that. Let's scroll down to the very bottom. And then we're gonna fire up our knowledge base. So we need a bit of code from our knowledge base to make this work. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna go to our official website then to our knowledge base by the way our official website has all the showcase for our all the add-ons and their feature list and knowledge base for all those add-on and tutorials like this feel free to check them out at wp-eventmanager.com so in here we're gonna search for the knowledge base so that should be show there if we type show it says hide show registration button on specific events that's exactly what we are looking for and in down here we have a block of code so we're gonna copy the entire code and then we're gonna paste it in our functions.php so a little tips over here if you're using a child theme then you are good to go you can just paste this code in your themes functions.php file and that should do it but if you're using a non-child theme like a parent theme so make sure you save your changed function.php or this code snippet somewhere save so upon a theme update or upgrade you don't lose your customization in long run before saving changes we need to make one little change so that should be the first opening php tag from the code we just copied so that would be that Let's format this code a little bit. It looks little unorganized. And by the way, if you find any error or any difficulties understanding these guides and tutorials, let us know in the comment. We will prove our knowledge base regarding your suggestions. So that's pretty much look good to me. Let's save these changes. So what we just did here, um, nothing but we added few hooks so we can i will show you what change it did to our website so this is few hooks we added to allow users or admins to set registration button visibility for a single particular event so i'm not really explaining what each function does but in in short uh, we added some meta box and uh, hooked it to our event submission form and we will see the changes right about now so let's switch back to our event details page and let's edit this event. So if we look closely in our right hand sidebar, we will see a new section called registrations button meta box. So this code section over here, this add meta box registration button meta box, this added this toggle button over here, hide registration button. So this input uh, right here, the checkbox is generated by, uh, if you look closely inside our uh, callback function we have label and input so this two uh, html element is being showed over here using hooks so no need to go inside deep technical terms over here you can just basically copy this code uh, from here and paste it into your functions.php but remember to remove the first starting php tag as is used for the formatter on our website so if we save changes and we can pretty much edit any event on the website. We will see this option at the right hand sidebar. And if we tick this checkbox and update our event. Now let's visit this event page. The registration button is gone. So if you come back to this page and remove this checkbox and update again, then reload this page. And the registration button is back again. 
so that's how simple it is to enable or hide the registration button for a single event and this uh, registration button meta box will show for all the events you have in your website when you go ahead and edit those event you will always see the registration button meta box on your right hand sidebar so it's always there so if you need to hide the registration button for that event if you are having any difficulty understanding any of the steps showed in this video let us know in the comment we will surely help you out and we have a great knowledge base uh, related to this video you can always check that out for written instructions and you can always visit our knowledge base for written instruction as well and being that said we are pretty much at the very end of the video if you found this video helpful a subscribe to the channel will be amazing so i'm sure signing off thank you for watching and i'll catch you in the next one